Mari 6 introduces the ability to auto-USD material files with Rnode, Randomman, USD Preview Surface and Principal BRDF shader bindings. In addition, having the ability to assign materials to certain selection face sets makes it even easier for artists to get ground truth render feedback which is perfect for verifying looks for dailies. Our USD look exporter works with a node graph setup using the normal channels workflow or using multi-channel bake points connected to the shader of choice. The artist can connect existing channels to different shader models if it is required for multiple shader bindings to be included in the look USD file. Alternatively, material nodes or any other node tree needs to be connected to a shader model using a multi-channel bake point. Mari uses the multi-channel bake point settings, such as resolution, bit depth or color space rows for exporting the textures. Naming all of the desired shaders for export to their equivalent material is essential for easily setting up the USD look exporter. Now that the node graph is set up for export, we can continue with assigning USD materials to the appropriate shaders using the USD look exporter that is situated under the export manager. The USD materials for export can be added or removed by using the UI button. The shader for export can be chosen using the drop-down menu under the appropriate shader model. The drop-down is listing all available shaders in the project so that they can be easily assigned to the USD material. The artist can also assign multiple shaders to be associated with the USD material if such exists in the project. Selection groups can be used to assign the correct face sets to the materials within the exported USD look. Using the Assigned Selection Groups UI window, the artist can choose one or multiple selection groups to be associated with the material. On the left side of the material, an icon will indicate whether a selection group is assigned. All of the image settings for export can be easily modified using the Edit Shader Inputs UI window. Similarly to the normal export manager controls, the artist can enable or disable streams, change resolution, bit depth, color space row or assign a post-process command. When the export has completed, the artist can open the USD assembly file in their look dev DCC. The materials are exported and correctly assigned to the face sets, giving the ability to get a first draft of the look with minimal effort. 